Sun's slowly coming up. Okay, now I get it. This was the pit. This is that pit in all those pictures. Where all the bodies were shot and thrown. Rest in peace. This is one of the execution pits. Mass execution here. Far out. I think this is where they Got dug up too and burnt. Holy. That's insane. This is a monument to the Jews and everybody who was executed here. Heavy stuff, man. All the different faces. The hands are different, look. I was watching this thing on YouTube and the guy was talking about what different faces mean and the hands there in the face of like they've given up and then it slowly goes to the hand the hand closing into a fist Can't quite see it yet, but when the sun comes up, all oh. we'll go down and read this one. Wow, that's powerful, man.
a Plazo concentration camp, the German Nazi concentration camp Plazo, established in October 1942 on the grounds of Jewish cemeteries. Initially, it was a forced labour camp and was attended for approximately 4,000 inmates. Jews from Krakow ghetto liquidated in March 1943 in the years 1943 to 1944. The Jews from the liquidated ghettos in Bosnia, Tarnow, Felika, Rezdal, Rezimzil, and a camp in Zebnia was put in Plaza. In July 1943, the Germans established a labor education camp for Poles within the territory of Kajal Plastel. Inhabitants of Krakow and victims of punitive military actions in towns and villages of the Krakow region were kept here. In January 1944, the forced labor camp was turned into a concentration camp. Kajal Plastel was also a transit camp for Jews from Slovakia, Hungary, being directed to Auschwitz, Burkina from spring 1944 is also a destination for transports from camps in Lublin and Radom, Radom, Radom districts. From KL Plaza, the transports were sent to forced labour and concentration camps in the general government and the Reich. It is estimated that throughout the whole period of the camp operation, the number of inmates exceeded 30,000, while the number of victims is assessed at approximately 5,000. The most numerous group of them were the Jews. The victims of liquidation. Krakow ghetto and caught with Aryan papers condemned to death during selections made in the camp. Poles and gypsies were also killed in execution carried out within the camp. Furthermore, the territory of the camp is where the prisoners of the Krakow, Montoblik prison, Poles, Jews, Germans, and other nationalities were shot. People were killed and buried in three places of execution. In the camp's peak period, mid-1944, the number of inmates exceeded 20,000 and its facilities amounted to approximately 200, including barracks for the inmates and workshops, utility buildings, camps, infrastructure buildings and houses and flats occupied by the camp personnel. In this period, the total area of the camp was covered in 80 hectares. In August 1944, a liquidation process of Kaya Plazao began. The Germans started to carry away the prisoners and the camp infrastructure, parts of barracks, workshop equipment, etc. On the 14th of January 1945, the last group of approximately 600 KR Plaza inmates set off towards Auschwitz. From 19 January to October 1945, Renault units were stationed within the camp, ravaging its remains. When the Russians left the camp, it became a public area and the process of destruction continued. This archive, archival photo is taken in 1943-1944, come from the collection of the Institute of National Remembrance in the United States Holocaust Memorial Museum. Wow. There you go. That's what we were just walking around. That's what we were just walking around. Far out. There's another sign down there. 